Good morning, welcome to another episode of this Umber series. I'm Anna Ford and we are waking up at 3 a.m. to get ready to go to Masjid Nabawi to pray Fajr prayer. Um, we're just getting ready, getting dressed. Um, we got to the hotel, literally knocked out. <laughs> It was a long flight, the long, then the train ride was two hours, and a taxi was 20. All that combination is a lot of energy to exert. Plus it's really hot here. It's, it's, it's intense. The sun, we have the sun hits the side of the earth. It's different than our side of the earth when New York is. Um, but yeah, alhamdulillah, we made it here. We're so thrilled to be in Medina. It's, Already there's like a sense of peace, but we haven't been to the masjid yet. We literally went to the hotel, slept, we even had dinner, like it was, we were just that tired. But right now we're heading to the masjid to go uh, perform the fajr prayer. And uh, we're getting breakfast after that at our hotel and then we'll go from there. This is my outfit. This is uh, Anjo Barbara from Al Shams. They're really good. Um, they are located in New Jersey. So if you want a nice vibe, I don't buy a Jill Bob that's really long. It's a Jill Bob actually, I just have it like, not cover my head right now, but I have a headscarf to place it over. So it's a two-piece jilbab. So it's like the top here and it comes with the skirt at the bottom. And it also has a niqab too, um, which you can wear as an option. But yeah, it's very light. I'm hoping I can beat the heat with this. You hear it, right? Yes, I can hear it. I see. Oh my God, I can't believe what I'm seeing on YouTube. Allah has given me the opportunity to do here in life. I said this, let me get up. I will give you guys a full hotel tour and hotel tour room um, later when it's clean. <laughs> we literally, like I guess I literally came to the hotel and passed out. Um, now it's the best, <laughs> sort of. Um, so yeah, I don't think I want to film that yet until after room service comes and cleans it. So I expect that later. Um, but it'll be like a maybe a separate vlog, just so people who are searching up this hotel know how it looks like um, and what to expect, how far is it from the message the walk so i'm gonna film all that because i think it's important i'm staying at the dar al iman the jacobson until hotel it's literally opposite machine Nabui. so it's very convenient you can just walk to the mosque in five minutes and you're there let's head out now Women are going down there. Okay. I saw them beauty. Yeah, let's just go here then. I see a cat over there. I know. We just gave us somebody just came and gave us like dates. I can't believe we're here. We just did like the two raka to um, greet the masjid. And after that, we're just waiting for the adhan. I mean, I shouldn't go and get Sam Sam water because we're thirsty. <laughs> um, people are generous here. They're giving out like free dates. So, mashallah. It's really nice. See? Okay, hold on. Okay, it's pouring out.
always grasshoppers here. Woo! Just praying Fajr prayer 
and it's only gonna rise in like 22 minutes but this is typically when i wake up for fajr i eat like 10 minutes before sunrise to pray so this is the first time in a long time i've woken up super early for fajr hey guys what's up <laughs> it is our mom <laughs> They just hijacked my phone. But anyways, <laughs> that's my family. We're here. All three of us are here. We just finished playing Fudger, as I said. But yeah, it's beautiful. It's about to rise in my 20 minutes. It looks beautiful here. After this, we're going to eat breakfast, as I said, because we're so hungry. We just had Zam Zam water. I think, they were, I think it was Zam Zam. Right. I didn't really mark it. I'll be real honest. There's nothing that says Zam Zam water by the fountains. It'd be funny if it wasn't. <laughs> just like, oh, I feel so good. Wow. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe it I was. Guess it was. Maybe it was Zam Zam. I know. Or was it inside? Kind of. They, they put it in like the, the white containers, right? You know what? So yeah, that maybe, regular, maybe, maybe that was regular water. water. <laughs> we'll look it up. But we know that there's Zam Zam inside. They have the containers that actually mark Zam Zam. And then they have the hot, they have the room temperature version and they have the cold version. So they're inside the masjid. So, inshallah, after we eat, we're going to come back and like look for it. But. <laughs> If that was his episode, that's a bad <laughs> We're like, woo, you didn't even record it. Yeah, we were like, oh, this tastes so good. <laughs> but anyways, okay, so our our hotel is like right outside, like like literally like right there. Like not behind me, but it's like the next building, which is behind Aisha's head. It's right there, so like we exit out the the hotel and it's like it's not even five minute walk, it's like literally two minutes. I would say it's a one minute walk even. It's great. So alhamdulillah, I'm glad we got a hotel that's super nearby the masjid and it's next to the women's entrance which is, um, I think it's gate 16 through 14 but I'll just double check, it's usually on the website but yeah, let's eat breakfast um, I did not vlog my breakfast, this is the empty plate, I'm so sorry <laughs> I think I will vlog my breakfast tomorrow, I was just so hungry guys but it was really good our yeah. hotel plan came with free breakfast and it's all buffet so <laughs> definitely i'm gonna have a separate video for like the buffet breakfast here at this hotel it's really exceptional yeah, it's so i really recommend coming here Stop me if I start recording. Okay, what about glasses? I'm leaving my shop, but it's okay. So we're on King Fahd Road. Um, this is where you get the back of the Masjid Nabawi and it's like a walk. You see a lot of stores and coffee shops, food, juices, trinkets, anything you can find <laughs> for anything you need. It's gonna be here on King Fahd Road. It is the back of Masjid Nabawi. Um, and there's a lot of options. There's commercial options, there's local options. And there's also construction, which is very odd. Like it's actually out in the open. They're doing a lot of construction and upgrades in Medina, um, which is great because they have this whole 2030 vision. I think it's part of 2030 vision. Um, so yeah, I'm not sure. It's very nice. It's not that bad outside. It's pretty warm. It's warm, 80 degrees, and going up to like 97. <laughs> um, I just thought that's hot. But for now, we're just walking around, enjoying the sights. Mashallah, there's pigeons everywhere. There's like beautiful scenery in the mosque. Um, I love it. It's really comfortable here and nice to walk down. Definitely when you're here, take time to like walk, see the area, um, either early in the morning or, or at nighttime when the sun goes down because it's really hot in the daytime. Um, it's much cooler at nighttime. 
Yeah, let's keep exploring. Medina was the immigration destination of the Prophet, peace be upon him, who had lived there and was buried there after his death. Medina is actually the second holiest city in Islam. This is right after Mecca, which is where the Kaaba resides. That is the gist of Medina. There is so much more to this beautiful city, but I will cover that in the next vlog, inshallah. But in the meantime, we actually explored a bit, we actually went shopping, and I got myself a prayer rug, which was beautiful, mashallah. Headed back to our hotel, we then came out and made Maghrib prayer and Isha as well. We were so exhausted and still jet lagged from the trip. But guys, this is the end of the vlog. Thank you for watching. Be sure to subscribe for the next episode. I'm very excited to show you guys the tour of Medina, the city itself. It is absolutely breathtaking. I cannot wait to show you guys. Thanks. Bye.